Well, the story of my 8-speed Sturmy Archer hub failure does have a happy ending. After I sent Sturmy Archer pictures of the broken pawl tooth and the broken ring gear tooth, they shipped me a complete new internal assembly and uh, didn't require any proof of purchase or anything like that. They just uh, shipped me a new assembly. It showed up at my door. So now that I've got this thing in hand, I decided with nothing to lose, I was going to reassemble the old hub assembly uh, after cleaning all of the debris out of it and everything and uh, oil lubricate it with ATF and uh, just see how it works and see how far it goes. So anyway, cleaned up the hub shell real good. Grease lubricated all of the uh, all of the bearings to keep the uh, keep the ATF sealed inside. I ran some ATF down in the uh, shift poles, let it run down into the shift cams there to make sure that was all nice and lubricated. After installing the first planet stage, I uh, ran some lube directly in there because I didn't want to submerse it uh, that far into the ATF to contaminate the bearings. The C-clip I replaced. Then I uh, dunked it right straight into the ATF. Let it drip a little bit. And then installed it back into the hub shell. You can actually uh, run oil directly into the non-drive side with the cone removed. So with the whole thing reassembled and put back in the bike, it's time to take it for a test ride. Let's see how this thing does. So out on the path, take it through its paces, every gear, shifts are nice and smooth, not a single hiccup, no missing, no skipping. Up and down, down and up. Torque good and hard on the pedals, particularly fourth gear. That's the one that had the issue before. Took it on an 18 kilometer run. Tried to push it up some, some grades, see if I could make it skip. No issues at all. Stopped on the way home and picked up a couple of panniers full of groceries. Again, made it, made it home with no issues at all. So big thumbs up to Sturmy Archer. Great customer service. Great product. Thanks for watching.